How's it going everybody? Uh, welcome back to the main brew guy YouTube channel. Today I have a uh, special treat for you. Um, I was going to post a kind of an update on my beer, um, which I will do. I'm going to still film that today um, after this, but I'm going to post this one first. So I went, a little backstory. Um, this is Trillium Vicinity, a double IPA. I have been dying to try Trillium. I am I am so excited. I went out for my buddy's 21st birthday last night. Uh, we went to a local, uh, like, we went to oh, Orna Brewing Company here. And, yeah, he was like, hey, I'll trade you one of Trillium's beer for one of my beers. I was all for it because I've got so many of them. So, thank you, Brian. Um, I am pumped to try this. I have been waiting to try to try any type of trillium um the can is just they're super sleek and he lives right down by him so he picked it up this weekend but all right we'll go through the can i'll give you guys another look let me back it up a little bit boom so it says vicinity double ipa eight percent alcohol by volume brewed in massachusetts trillium brewing um, that just, the general warning. Wow, not much on the can, but it looks like oysters, like an oyster, uh, it's, those are oysters, I believe, and that's a oyster shucking knife, and let's crack into it, because I'm excited. Ugh, let's go. Woo! Oh, that smells delicious. Let's pour her out. Wow, what beautiful color. Keep that there for you guys for a few minutes, for not minutes, seconds. Beautiful head on it. You, it's, you can't even see through. This is definitely a double IPA. She's hazy. Let's get a little smell. Oh, citrus. I'm getting kind of a little spicy something. Not much, but kind of on the back end of the... It kind of like tingles my nose a little bit. But yeah, the carbonation level is beautiful. Um, I still see it rising up off the bottom. I mean, it looks like a glass of orange juice or like a mimosa with a lot of orange juice in it. Um, this is crazy. Wow. All right. I hope this is uh, exactly how I've been expecting it to be. Let's uh, go in for a taste. That is incredibly smooth for a double IPA. Um, usually I've found with a lot of double IPAs that are at least up here, they're kind of chewy in the back. But this one goes right away i mean it's like wow that is delicious it's very smooth and creamy um you still get a little bit of a bitterness but the eight percent is hidden incredibly well um wow that is Let's uh, finish pouring the rest that's in. Wow. I am... I am... This makes me want to go down to Boston. Or actually Canton, I believe. And, uh... Holy crap, I want to go there. I need to go to Trillium. This is incredible. Yeah, like I said, I'm getting like a slight bitterness level. Very moderate, moderate bitterness. Like, almost no bitterness towards the end. Um, it finishes so smooth. It's like drinking silk, almost. It, it just goes down and it like feels good on your throat. This is crazy. You don't get a... 
no sweet smell. You don't smell the alcohol in it, which is awesome. Um, I, I've had some double IPAs that you can tell it's a double IPA, but this one, I would say it's a hazy New England IPA. Like, it's nowhere near what I would think of as a double IPA, but this is fantastic. Wow. Yeah, they definitely dry hopped it. I'm definitely getting some citrus. Um, the spicy note that I was smelling, I'm not really getting. I'm getting a lot of just citrus. Um, a little bit of orange peel. Actually, maybe a little bit of spiciness on the end. Not, not substantial spiciness, just a, a smidgen. But, alright, I'm going to rate this now. I don't know price wise. I would give this a nine. I could drink this every day and not get tired of it. Um, maybe it's a fact that all the hype I've known of Trillium, um, I follow them on Instagram and stuff and like keep track of what they're doing and this is incredible. I mean, it goes down like juice. I'll give you guys one more shot of the can. So yeah, I am impressed. Um, Got to give a shout out to my buddy Brian. Uh, thank you for giving me this because it's definitely worth the trade. Hopefully you enjoy mine, my uh, my beer. I know it's definitely not a double IPA. It's a uh, just a, a blackberry pale ale, not much hoppiness and stuff, but yeah, just thank you. Thank you, and I appreciate, maybe we'll uh, switch some beers more often, because this is delicious. So I think I'm going to finish this off camera, probably pretty damn quick. Um, I could just crush a hundred of these. These are, I just can't get over how good this is. Wow. Wow. All right, well, I'm going to sign off. Um, don't forget to thumb up the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, it will really help me out. And check back for more content because I'll be posting some more stuff soon. Uh, cheers.